Hey guys, what's going on? Uh, I just thought I'd make a quick video uh, showcasing the poker software that we are going to be using on Friday night. Um, I'm pretty new to it myself, uh, but I thought that it would be beneficial for everyone uh, as well as the game if uh, we were semi-familiar with it as a group uh, before we sat down to play on Friday night. So without further ado, I am going to get it started. Um, I already have a table created, so what you guys will do is you will come to your browser and enter the link, and then you will be prompted to sit at one of nine seats. Now, uh, this is an example. The blinds are two cent, five cent, and I have bought in for five dollars. Uh, so let's say Josh wants to buy in for the same five dollars. Uh, what I'm going to do is collect everyone's money on Venmo, if that's not a problem, and then redistribute it at the end of the night uh, based on everyone's chip count. So, again, let's say Josh wants to join. He would click sit, he would type his name, and click request. You will be prompted with this until I add you, and I'm going to add $5 worth of chips to Josh. And that should do it. So now Josh is at the table with his $5 as well. Uh, and we are ready to start, or at least for the example we are. Once everyone is uh, at the table, I would click Start Game. And the first hand would be dealt instantly. So you can tell it is on Josh right now because of the glow around his name, chip stack, and hand. Uh, here is where the hand ranking is. This will show you exactly what you actually have uh, in poker. Just for the example, I'm going to call. And now you can tell it's on me again because of the glow and the timer uh, as well. This is the timer. If it, in, if it uh, goes down to here, you will either fold your hand or automatically check, depending on what's going on. I'm going to check on my end. And we'll see a flop. King, queen, ten. So uh, it, the action is on me. I am going to check. And you have lots of options uh, when the action is on you, which we will go over now. It is Josh's turn, and he can either check, bet, or bet five. So let's say for this example he wants to bet five cents. He would click the bet five button. Now let's say I want to call. What I would do is click the call button and we will take a turn. Ace. Josh makes a straight here with his jack. So this actually will work out perfectly. Um, I will check here and Josh would obviously want to bet, but let's say Josh wants to bet more than five, five cents. Well, that would be fine because if he clicks bet, all these options are available to him. He can either type in how many cents he wants to bet here or use the slider. We'll just bet five because his turn was about to be over. And I will call as well and we will see a river. So this time I am going to check again and I am going to use the slider to bet instead of typing it in. Just for the example's sake, you can obviously continue to use the bet, uh, just to, to type in uh, a number if you'd like. Uh, but let's just use a slider. Let's say he wants to bet 18, so that's what I would do. If I wanted to bet 18, set the slider and then click bet. And for the sake of the example, I am going to call into Josh's straight and lose with my pair of queens. So uh, Josh just won 60, a 66 cent pot, and now we have our new stacks. Josh is sitting pretty at $5.28. I'm uh, at $4.65. Coming for you, Josh. Uh, so anyway, to uh, go for the second hand example, I'm just going to call. Josh has 610 off here. Uh, I'm just going to check. And... Uh, He's going to flop middle pair here. Again, you can tell it's his turn. 
it's glowing, you can see the timer, and also you will be prompted with a little beep on your end as well, a little audio, audio beep as well. Uh, just for the example sake, I'm going to check back. Excuse me, I'm going to check and I'm going to check back. Wilson is. Queen on the turn. Um, okay, let's say Josh wants to bet seven here. Type in seven and click bet. And for the example's sake, I am going to call. Okay, and a 10 on the turn. Josh has made trips. So Josh will bet again. He probably wants to bet more than five. So let's say he, he bets 14 cents. And let's say I make the silly call. Josh is going to take down another pot. You can see 52 cents. So at this point, let's say we want to stop. So what I would do is I would count up everyone's money uh, that they are chip count that they have. For example, Josh has five dollars fifty nine cents, including the small blind that's on the table. So I would send him five dollars and fifty nine cents, and the hands are going to continue to play out um, as we count people's money. But I will be diligent and make sure everyone receives uh, the correct amount. So. I would Venmo, like I said, I would Venmo him what he had last hand, and I would have Venmoed myself four dollars and forty, uh, I guess eight cents, forty-eight cents is what I had. So uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm gonna uh, quit here, and uh, yeah, that would be it. So uh, if you have any more questions about the software, or you would like to uh, play with me for fun. Uh, before we start on Friday night, I would be happy to. Um, yeah, let me know if y'all need anything, and I guess that's it. Peace.